So we are about to watch the third episode of the eighth season of Game of Thrones. The battle for... We're just going to keep going. Battle for Winterfell. We are already shook. Like, I st my stomach yes. is just in knots I, I i'm i almost feel like i'm having trouble breathing i care way too much about this show obviously you knew that um so we're just gonna really quickly i don't know to like do a little death pool predictions thing um yeah, won't good. take up too much of your time i promise i'll try so all right who will die tonight unfortunately i ha we're in agreement sorry to speak for you um Brienne. Brienne is going to die tonight. The last episode was that, named... Neither do I. last episode was named for her. She had that amazing moment with Jamie. She was knighted. We saw her smile, this smile that we have never seen before. Yeah. I want to say we haven't quite wrapped up her arc, but we probably have. I'm... I'm banking on her dying, protecting Jamie. I am banking on her inheriting uh, Oathkeeper. Oath, no. Oath no, Keeper she already has Oathkeeper. I'm sorry. I don't know. What was I going to say? You were going to say that Jamie would, would have both pieces of ice. That, that's what it is. I'm sorry. Widow's but Whale. Not and Brienne, and, Brienne doesn't inherit anything Widow's because Whale she's going to die. Keeper. I'm talking about Jamie inheriting Brienne's sword, Oathkeeper, which he gave her. Uh, which which would mean he would have both Widow's Whale, Joffrey's Old Sword, and Oathkeeper, Brienne's Sword, which was once, all put together, Ice, Ned Stark's Sword. Yep. So uh, that could happen. Just throwing it out there. Um, who else will die? Theon. I feel like I, I am 100% sure on this one. His arc is fully wrapped with a bow he he redeemed himself uh with his sister he saved he her um he's about to redeem himself with bran the other person he like seriously betrayed um i think he will die protecting bran in the godswood in the godswood and i th I, th I think this is it for theon I, i'm very comfortable saying that thank you alfie for acting that part fantastic work beautiful um, third death we are pretty fucking certain about Jora, Sir Friend Zone, best bestie out there. <laughs> um, I I I think you know that scene in the last episode with Sam giving him heart Spain. I, yeah, I, there was just something so poetic about that. So seemingly final. I don't I don't know. Parallel I, with a uh, long claw. He's he's got. I mean, I think it would be really weird if he didn't die protecting Danny. I feel like Danny has to be the person he is protecting yeah. when he dies. Um, mm. Just I, that we see him riding at the front right. of a column. He he's going to be in leading people. Uh, all right, who else is gonna die? Um, Onion Knight, Sir Davos. No. Big no. We love you so much. Hope so. Totally but gonna die. He's most likely going to die. I think he's probably going to die. Um, Biggest fans. Maybe he'll remember the the girl with Grayscale who reminds him of Shireen. Mm -hmm. He'll remember she's in the crypts. And it's pretty obvious from the trailers that they aired before the season began. Shit's going down in the crypts. So maybe he remembers she's down there. He tries to save her. He like sees that she's a white or something and he dies. I don't know. But maybe... Parallel to the Probably mother Sir, at home, but Sir Davos is yeah. going to die in this episode. And we love him. And we love him. Okay, really quickly, uh, not going into too much detail, other people we think will probably die in this episode. Um, Beric. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, Tormund. So sorry. Biggest I was fan. I was totally shipping Tormund and Brienne last season. Um, I, I, I I can, I don't know, however you want to say it. Um, I, after watching him like make a total ass out of himself in front of her last week, I can see that she, she's probably not going to go for somebody that seemingly juvenile. I, I don't know. I've, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with them not winding up together. Would have been cool, but she probably needs someone more intelligent, more, I, I don't know. You're saying Jamie. 
she needs Jamie. But he, anyway. Um, so yeah, I, th- I think Tormund just might die this episode. I'll be thrilled if he lives, but he might die. Um, Dolores Ed, I think it's pretty much a given that he'll die. Um, John and Sam might wind up the only members of, of the, the Night's, Night's Watch. Watch to survive. Um, uh, Gendry, not 100% on this, but I I feel like he could probably, possibly die in this episode. Um, Varys, I'm not 100% on this. He thinks it's a, it's a definite. I'm sorry to say, but I think that our Varys will be an ice spider by the end of the evening. He did not tell me that earlier. That's good. Someone said That's that before. That's good. Someone said that before. Okay, you got it from I'm somebody sure. else? No, no. I just, right. I just said it, but I'm sure that someone said it before. That's good. I like that. I didn't, I didn't read it anymore. I did I like that. Ice Spider. Come on. Um, okay. And and who else? Grey Worm. Grey Worm um, is dead as hell because he Grey started Worms. dreaming of a place off, off of uh, Grey Worm's off done. the camp. Come on. I also, I'm throwing this out there. I, he does not agree with me on this. I think it's quite possible that Masande will kill herself. She doesn't have a place in this world anymore. That's a great she, call. She it does not fit with the barbarian. She force. only fits with Grey Worm. He, he's with Grey Worm. her anchor. He, he is what tethers her to any kind of enjoyment of life at this point. So, so yeah. you know, regardless of her commitment to Danny, I don't know. I just... I, something in me just it's quite quite possible for me my i only, can see it she might kill herself i agree um my only thought is she won't make it to the end yeah but we're we're, we're trying to limit ourselves to just what's jump, going to happen jump. in this upcoming episode oh yeah yeah um i think I, she'll I, make it I, to there's A4. very few people will make it to the end but I think she'll make it to A4. you think she'll make it okay A4. i'm i'm voting for suicide we'll see what happens um if not very metal of you, i don't honey. want it but Okay, uh, uh, oh, oh, um, let's talk about dragons really quickly. Go. So, I didn't even really want to think about this. He brought this up. I brought this up. A dragon's probably going to die in this episode. And we were talking about who, who of the two, if a dragon dies, if, say, Viseri- Viserion kills a dragon, who would it be? We would like to think it would be Rhaegal because Drogon is Danny's dragon. He's like the main dragon. He's the strongest dragon. Yep. But what has George R. R. Martin done to us time and time again, again through the course of this fucking story? You know, he has turned everything on its head. He has killed the people we thought could not be killed. Again people, and again. dragons, whatever. And um, also, it would be pretty poignant if the only dragon left on the side of the living is the dragon named for John's father, since that's the dragon he rode. And since I am also beyond this episode, banking on Jon Snow living a little longer than Daenerys, it would make sense for me, for, for Rhaegal to be the dragon that survives. Hmm. So if a dragon were to die this episode, I hate to say it, but I think it could possibly be Drogon. Um, A few other things, not necessarily who's going to die, but um, I I don't think the hound is going to die this episode. I, when there's Clegane bowl, Clegane bowl caveat, if he does die in this episode, then I think Arya will take his place in Clegane bowl as, as a, faceless hound. I, I don't know how you say it. Or but someone with the red words could bring him back. Not a faceless hound. Uh, or, yeah, right, exactly. Oh, that's the other thing. Mel, <laughs> this is like such a mess. I'm where is sorry. Mel? No, let's Mel, going. where is Mel? Mel, Mel could very, li- like, I think it's pretty likely that Mel will show up in this episode Maybe in a sort of uh, little finger Knights of the Vale way, you know, when they showed up and saved Bastard Bowl, she could show up with all the Lord of Light followers. I'm sure there's a army there that I'm forgetting about, but just you know, her her peeps who follow the Lord of Light, Kinvara and Essos, and peeps. Mel showing up with her peeps to sort of you know little finger the day, a la bastard bull 
Um, that's a possibility. Um, last thing I wanted to mention. So, you know, we've all been speculating. What does Arya, in the trailer that we saw before the season began, what is scaring the fuck out of Arya what is frightening her? in the crypts? Because we don't see Arya frightened all that often. It's it's a it's a rarity. Especially now. Um, and, you know, everybody all over the internet has been saying, you know, it's probably family members. Maybe it's Catelyn. Maybe this is how they they uh, integrate Lady Stoneheart, a uh, character from the books, mm-hmm. the undead mm-hmm. Catelyn Stark. Um, I would be beyond delighted if they featured a scene with Arya running away from undead no head Ned. Like, I think that that would just be everything. Like, I, it would be headless, a, a terrifying callback. Headless undead Ned, Ned the dead with no head, however you want to say it. It's <laughs> it rhymes no matter how you say it. That's the cool thing. There's Ned, Ned, Ned and head, no head and dead, and you can just fill in everything else you need to fill in. Um, I think that's what Arya is running from. Because uh, here's the thing: God. all of the bodies in the crypts at this point um, are pretty decomposed by now. Most of them are just skeletons. But so what whites? would be recognizable? You know, what would be recognized? A headless body. Exactly. That would be the most recognizable. Uh, So for that reason, I think it's it's um, it's a possibility that we will see uh, undead Ned Saul's head again, however you want to put it. Um, But okay, I, I I've been rambling on long enough. I haven't given you any time to speak. Do you? Is there anything you want to say before we start? Because really I'm want good. To start. I followed your outline. Okay, we're gonna start watching the episode now. Okay, clap. Let's stop everything and yeah! export these pieces, and then let's let's do it. Bring on the death. Bring on the death. Bring on the death. <laughs> No, no, no. You don't need... Move. You hide. You hide. Move. Oh, Sam, don't be scared. Come on. Sam the Slayer. Be brave, Sam. God, please survive. Please survive. Well, he and Bran are the memory. Liana, pulling her weight, shouting orders. Oh God, Tyrion. This is one long, unbroken shot. Ghost. <gasps> That's why I forgot to mention we're gonna lose Ghost. I'm pretty sure Ghost is gonna die. I'm sorry. I'm horribly sorry. I hope it doesn't happen. I'm pretty sure we're gonna lose Ghost. Wait, this isn't an undead person. Yes! It's Mel! It's Mel! Where did you come from? Like I said! I knew Mel would show up! Speak their tongue. <laughs> Tell them to lift their swords. Where did you come from? Tell them to lift their swords? Do you even know our axe sharpened? Do you have an army with you, Mel? Did you bring peeps? No. Please tell us you brought peeps. I excuse on you. Oh, 
Okay, redemption for Mel. No. Mel, no. Well, never fully, but. That's great. Thanks for the power. That's up. great. Thank you. Yeah, Fireball Mario. She was the fire flower. God, there she is. Knew she'd show. Let's have this conversation. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's got those eyes. Those Davos eyes. Oh, my God. Kill her. No. There's no need to execute me, Sir Davos. Not yet. I'll be dead before the dawn. <gasps> she knows what's going down. She knows she's dying. Oh God. There we go. Oh God. We're to see the lights snuffed out by, one by one. Oh gosh, you're right. There's gonna be like half the light. In a... The lights will turn off. Oh God. Oh God. Shit. Oh yep. God. Go. These are your people, Danny. They followed you here. Everyone's joining in. It's happening! It's happening! Oh, God. Yes. Drawing ghost. Oh, of course he's leading the death Yes. <gasps> It's just gonna stop. Yeah. Right there. No, 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 no. Bad plan. Oh god, we're gonna see all the fire go out. Why would they even start this way? Wasn't this supposed to be strategic? Bad call. This is not... God! Yeah. All of the Dothraki warriors are now part of the Night King's army. Every single Dothraki warrior. Oh my god. Jorah. What about Jorah? What about Ghost? The horse came back. <laughs> it's gonna get worse from here. Get in the air! The Night King is coming. Get you in the air! Are fucking the dead are already here. Dragons! Why are you not in the air? You can't be afraid to lose more. You have to use them. You have to use the biggest weapon you have now. Get down to the crypt. No. I'm not abandoning my people. Do not. Take this and go. Do not. Do not. I don't know how to use it. Sticking with the pointy end. <laughs> Thank you, Ed. You should not be on the front lines, my friend. Shouldn't be. You should not be here. Get up. It is lucky that you're still alive. <gasps> Ed, no! Damn it! 
Sam! Oh, oh it's Ed. creepy as fuck. Oh, God. Sansa's gonna show us the crypts are fucked. First death of someone we know it's and love. Oh, Raise a glass, it. Dolores said. Number one. The only one I fully know who has blood armor right now is Arya. Because George's wife threatened to leave him if he kills her. Famously. Yes! She's leading her own fucking battalion! She was protecting the hound! She couldn't have seen him. That was her first arrow, yo. It was used to kill someone who was about to kill the hound. Oh god, Grey Worm. Grey Worm. You're so brave. You're so brave. And you found love. <laughs> You're gonna die. Please let her shit work. Yes. Yes! You, Light much. the trenches! Light those fucking trenches! Yes! <sighs> My moat's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Thanks, Bill. Whew.